Okay, so you've just been watching me build these, which are the exoskeleton strapping system for Iron Man's shoes and boots. If you've been watching the previous videos, then you'll notice that I've been doing um, basically a frame like this for the whole body. So if we just quickly go and have a look at the rest of the suit. I've got um, a metal undercage. This is actually the, the fifth part of the video on this. So there's a further four parts if you go back through my channel to have a look. And all of the parts are attached with these special magnetic plugs and sockets which I've made. So um, basically this is about the boots and shoes. And what we've got here of course is um, a shoe covered with foam inside this frame which I've just built. Um, with floating ankle joints so you can move your legs in all directions. And obviously pivots at the ball of the foot there. I've actually run out of Velcro which is why this one hasn't got its strap on like this one which basically holds your foot in. But you can see with that one that you can you know, walk in that quite well. I've actually um, tried this on and walked around with one of them on. It's actually quite comfortable. So the next plan is to make all the plastic pieces. So I've got one shin here. That's one of the shins. That side, it's the uh, right hand shin. For now it does actually fit on here. be something like that. Uh, but basically the plan is to divide these, as I said before, into two halves. Which will make getting on and off rather a lot easier. There we go. So the plan is that the two halves will um, sort of fix onto this. There'll be another strap around the front and some extra pieces with the magnetic hooks and plugs and sockets on and at the back. And also the three rigid pieces of the shoe will all clip onto this. So what I'd quite like to do next is cut the shins up, make all the shoe pieces. And I'd quite like to actually have a mechanism where they kind of lever on, just like in the movie. Um, if I can't do that, they'll just hook on with the same magnetic latches I've used on the torso and some hooks. So the shins will probably hook on at the back and then have one magnetic plug and socket to latch them on. So that's all I have for this time. Watch out for the next video.